Hello! If you want to learn Japanese quickly and easily, without any books or classroom time, then you've come to the right place. Let's start talking right now. Hello, I'm Kerwin. And I'm Blaine. We're your hosts of the Easy Go channel, where you'll learn simple and easy Japanese short words and phrases so that you can start speaking Japanese right now. And what's the topic for today? Okay. Today we're going to be learning uh, descriptive words, words to describe different items mm -hmm. for, I guess, the vocabulary we've been touching on so far on these episodes. Uh, these will just be 10 simple descriptive words to get you started. And then on the next episode, we'll show you how to use them for different types of items. Okay. So, what's the first word for today? Uh, the first one's going to be for clean. Clean is going to be kire. Kire is going to be for clean. Kire. Uh, and that'll be for clean for our first one. So then how we say dirty. All right. Um, let's go opposite of clean and, like you said, dirty. And that's kitanai. The word for dirty is kitanai. All right. All right, and since we did clean and dirty, now we'll do hot and cold. So we're just doing opposites from this episode completely. So <laughs> okay. hot is going to be atsui. Atsui is going to be for hot. And that's going to be um, either if it's hot outside or hot to the touch. They both work the same way, so atsui. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, and the opposite of hot, of course, is cold. And so that would be samui. Samui is for cold. And then our next one will be uh, noisy. So noisy will be uh, urusai, urusai for noisy or even loud or just a loud noise in general. So urusai. <laughs> and opposite of noisy would be quiet. And that's shizuka. Mm. Shizuka, shizuka for quiet. Love me some of that. <laughs> our next one will be uh, big. So oki will be for big. Mm. And this will be for, you know, just describing sizes of something. So, oki for big. Oki. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> and the opposite of big would be small. So, and the word for small is chisai. Chisai is the word for small in Japanese. Mm -hmm. And then our next one will be fast. So, hayai for fast. Mm hayai. -hmm. Hayai will be for fast. So. Just generally giving out the speed for something or how fast you may do something. <laughs> and the opposite of fast is slow. <laughs> slow is the opposite of uh, uh, fast. And that would be osoi. Mm. Osoi. Osoi means slow in Japanese. Mm -hmm. So yeah, these are some simple uh, descriptive words that you'll hear all the time when you're learning Japanese. So I just wanted to get those started for you guys. And then on the second part of this video, we'll actually show you how we'll use these descriptive words um, to describe different items. And on that note, so please subscribe and hit the bell button so that you'll know when we put that video up and you can follow along with us. And if you haven't seen any of the videos before this, please go back to video one and start from the beginning. Not that they're progressing on each other, but we're starting from slow and simple words and we're getting a little bigger and a little faster. Okay, so check us out and um, we'll see you on the next episode. Matane. Matane.